In this video, we will be demonstrating how to check your spindle drawbar force by using our hydraulic clamp force gauge. Checking your machine's clamping force is a quick, easy process that should be part of a regular maintenance program. Most drawbars are built using a Belleville washer stack system to generate clamping force. The longevity of a Belleville washer can fluctuate from a few years to a few cycles, so frequent testing of the clamping force is required. If the clamping force falls below 80% of the original manufacturer's recommendation, the Belleville washers need to be replaced. Diminished spindle clamping force, which allows the tool holder to move within the spindle, can result in chatter, vibration, and decreased tool life. In extreme cases, it can result in a tool pulling out of the spindle during a cut and causing damage to the workpiece, the tool, the spindle, the tool holder, and also possibly the operator. It is never safe to assume that as long as a machine is clamping, it is functioning properly. The clamp force gauge is easy to assemble and use. First, choose the taper adapter for the machine you are checking. To assemble the gauge, thread the internal transfer screw into the threaded end of the gauge head and finger tighten as snugly as possible. Next, slide the large end of the taper adapter over the threaded end of the gauge head. We're demonstrating the gauge with a 40 taper adapter. If you're using a 50 taper adapter, you would first slide the large end of the taper adapter over the threaded end of the gauge head. Thread the internal transfer screw through the taper adapter into the threaded end of the gauge head and tighten the transfer screw with a provided wrench. The last step is to install a retention knob into the small end of the taper adapter. Because retention knobs are not universal, you must use a retention knob that is designed for the machine you are testing. Finger tighten the retention knob. Verify that the retention knob is fully seated on the taper adapter. Now that the gauge is assembled, testing the machine's clamping force is quick and easy. Using the manual tool change, insert the gauge into the spindle and then energize the spindle. Do not start the spindle after the test gauge is in the spindle. This could cause damage to the gauge or result in personal injury. The gauge instantly reads the pull force in foot-pounds. Remember to check your machines frequently. Once drawbar force drops below 80% of its original force that the factory has specified for your machine, it is time to schedule maintenance. For more information on this and other complimentary products, order a clamp force gauge or adapters, call toll-free 800-322-7750 or visit us online at www.jmperformanceproducts.com.